We are broadcasting live from what's left of Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena, one of the few structures to survive the big one. The fans are munching on tofu burgers, sipping Chardonnay, and getting ready for some Newton football. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Micro Hard Nutilators face off against the Los Scandalous Dam. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. Revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Oh, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Oh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but you know, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What the and it's first and ten. And like Bricks is fouls, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> And this is a first and low. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. Who's next? And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And it'll be second and eight to go. A great throw and a great catch. But bam, say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten.
go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. away like a greased pig. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And the offense has only two running backs left and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this act, man. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than comp... Oh, nice hit! And it's first and ten. He had it for a second there. Is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to fluff it, Ben. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. Second down and ten. And he's running like a moose right now. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Now, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better walk. And he just wrestles away from that. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to have survived so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the kill. If he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, kiss kiss say, what the fuck the fuck the fuck? <laughs> and it's first and ten. Quarterbacks can be hurting or dead or worse. Oh. 
Second down and long. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and, well, good luck. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know. He could go all the way. And they're catching up. Boom. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to fight it. He's at the 40. The 30. That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. And it's first and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. And the defense gets another pick. Man. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Lucky find his head. He'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Second and three. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Third down and the punter is warming up. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. <laughs> oh, and he looks like he just saw four. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. Oh, he just got crushed. Oh, 
you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Third down and long. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know about if they're ready. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. First and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And that'll be second down and four. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I'd be impressed if he splits the uprights from this far away, Bricks. Yeah, if he does it, they're going to split his skull wide open. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Probably be a better dancer if he went to dance class, but as you can see, he uh, doesn't have the stomach for it. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too.
Third down, and the punter is warming up. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make... Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Third down and ten. game there that's a solid pickup i wish people would do solid pickups more often two minute warning sounds time to get a beer hey get me one too well, i want sean kick and make a kick like this with his extra leg he used it like a golf club that wasn't a leg you moron that well surprise me he made it look easy and he gets three points for it Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. nothing out of it second down and ten oh and that's how you play defense well, of course he he could have had an interception returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game but I don't want to nitpick I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. And he's off to the races. And the defense is on his heels. He's at the ten. No touchdown today. Looks like that defender ate his... Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. 
When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And they line up for the extra point. goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the light. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to man at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. What a game is this close as the score indicates. <laughs> The kicker is going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. This guy's a brick shit house. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set. 
out of hands. And it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. First and four. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions. Oh, what the brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Hit the quarterback goes down. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he was stuck to him like glue. down and the offense needs a miracle. One, hot two, hot three. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that. Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. I'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking, and it don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. Third down and long. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. First and ten. He could go all the way. Well, back to the bench. He dropped it, you putts. Second down and ten. in there and swats the ball away. He came, oh my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. And it's first and 10. Quarterback must have learned a Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. He 
refuses to go down. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Third down and three. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is gonna have more boom dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's gonna kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message. Because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And that'll bring up third and one. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. You know, Briggs, we might be seeing the birth of a new dance craze. This guy may not be programmed to feel love or pain, but man, he is programmed to get down. Get funky. Get with it, brother. Get with it. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Second down and more. Oh, and the defense jumps on sides. And, and the whistle blows the play dead along with the quarterback. <laughs> the offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. Worst game in the game. What are you trying to play? And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can see that, Grim. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five!
And it's first and ten. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Oh my gosh! The defensive player looks like no doubt about it. That guy is dead. He says, "I'm taking you with me." For ten. Goal! Never do that again, Bricks. I'll shoot you in the head. But people like it. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. He goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Brick. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down in a mile. the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. A nice run there for eight yards. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. <laughs> He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast hammer sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. The Los Scandalous Damned are decimated today. They lose by forfeit. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Palin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League.
Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...